Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to the vlog. It is currently Thursday, October 10th, and it is 11.15 a.m. I've been up since about eight today. Today is like my chill day. I haven't vlogged at all this week because it has been madness. When I tell you everything is happening right now, everything's happening right now. So this week is midterms, which means we basically have like a test in every class. Um, but we also started our season last week. So we're pretty much showing every weekend. So it's just crazy, but I'm loving it. Um, I just wasn't able to vlog the last few days, which is the other thing I want to talk about real quick. I'll be really quick about it. I've been posting Tuesdays and Thursdays on here for a long time, and I'm still going to aim to do that every week. But if I, for whatever reason, don't post on a Tuesday or Thursday, just know it's because I either got too busy and wasn't able to finish editing, or I've been too busy to even film. Again, I'm still going to aim for Tuesdays and Thursdays, but October and November are really our busiest months. So bear with me. Saying that, I just finished editing a vlog going up today. To start uploading that, I just need to make a thumbnail. I have class at 12.30 and then I have an Apple store appointment at 2.15 to go get my old laptop fixed. And then this evening, I'm going to a burn gym class at 5.30 and it's right next to Trader Joe's. And so that's what today's vlog is gonna be. I haven't been to Trader Joe's in so long, which is so like weird because I love Trader Joe's. And the thing I love about it is they have healthier frozen meals. As a college student, nothing is better than an easy meal. Um, but as an athlete, I obviously care a lot about what I am eating and not eating junk food all the time. So I feel like Trader Joe's has a good balance because you can find some options that are frozen that are still healthier. So today we are going to go get some of those, but I'm gonna have some food right now because I haven't had breakfast. And I'm not gonna have time for lunch after class. So I have these soup dumplings. They're not actually the Trader Joe's ones because I haven't been, but they're like a knockoff version and I haven't been able to have them because you need a microwave to heat them up and I don't have a microwave here. However, I saw on TikTok that you can heat them up in the air fryer. So that's what we're going to do. Okay. Oh, I forgot. I put them over here. For anyone who's wondering or doesn't have a Trader Joe's near them, I get these from Stop and Shop and they're like literally the same exact thing. The Trader Joe's ones are slightly better. They have a little more soup, but these taste the same if that makes sense. I am probably going to get some real soup dumplings at Trader Joe's if they have them, but they're also always sold out. So again, great alternative. The TikTok says to put them straight on the tray in the air fryer, put it at 350 and leave them for like nine minutes and flip them consistently. So we're just gonna wing it. Put a little spray. I really don't know how this is gonna go, but honestly at this point, if I don't find a way to eat them, I'm just not gonna eat them. Also, look, they look exactly like the Trader Joe's ones. Air fry. 350 for nine minutes, and then we're gonna flip them halfway through. Okay guys, I took them out. I like kept having to turn the air fryer off to like turn them. So I don't actually know how many minutes it was, but I think it was definitely less than nine. And I think they're cooked all the way through. They smell amazing. So I'm gonna add some stuff to them. This is what I like to call the Tara Michelle dumplings. If you guys don't know who Tara Michelle is, she's one of my favorite YouTubers ever to watch. Um, and this is like her classic. So we add a little soy sauce to all of them. And then she always adds this stuff from Trader Joe's called Chili Onion Crunch. It says it doesn't expire till next year, so I'm just gonna hope that it's still good. All right, let's try. Guys, it worked. I've figured it out. I'm gonna eat these and then get ready for class. It's now time for me to leave for class. I have this Lululemon like scuba zip up hoodie on, jeans I always wear from Abercrombie, and then my Sambas, which I love. And I have my notebook in this little bag and then my old laptop that I'm taking to the Apple store. So let's go. When you like order groceries on Instacart, it automatically pays for those bags, which I understand because the paper bags are a pain. But because I paid for them, I've really turned into an adult now and I keep all my stop and shop bags right there. So when I go in the grocery store, I actually bring in my reusable bags. But honestly, it's so good. Helping the environment and I don't have to pay for bags. Great, my battery's gonna die. But I have to go to class anyway. So I'll talk to you later. Okay guys, sorry, my window's down. It is now 1.45. I obviously got out of class early, so I have a little bit more time before I have to be at the Apple store. So I'm swinging through a drive-thru to get myself a matcha as a little treat. And then we're gonna go get 
this laptop fixed and then when I get home my plan is to edit my main channel video for Monday so that I don't have to worry about it when I get back from showing this weekend because Monday I'm not going to be able to edit it anyway so I've gotta get on it this battery is also about to die so i need to order a second battery for this camera like i have for my other camera this is the bigger one with the wider lens and it's just better for vlogging i think okay guys it is 5 24 i'm gonna head into the gym now because it starts in a few minutes i'll talk to you after okay guys um, it is now 6 16 i just finished so sweaty but we're gonna head to trader joe's to get some things and i will show you that when i'm home we made it i'm gonna put back on my hoodie don't get followed or anything and then we're gonna go get some groceries which i'm so excited about if i can find my sleeve all right let's go all right we got some groceries so we're gonna head home and then i will show you what i got i'm pretty pleased i got a couple of like frozen meal meals to try that are healthier but then i also obviously got some fresh stuff i really liked that we have different flavors of grilled chicken that's already pre-cooked which is great for me because i'm a little weird about cooking chicken so i'm really excited to try that but let's go home here we go bye fendi Okay, don't mind the noise, it's the dishwasher. I got some raspberries, this cauliflower pinocchi that we were talking about, two avocados, some chili lime cooked chicken, some cheese tortellini, figured this could be a dinner at some point. Guys, they had the Trader Joe's soup dumplings, so I got two of them, because I don't want to have too many of them, but I wanted some. I'm gonna try these, because I love getting them from Dunkin' and stuff. These are the cheddar cheese and uncured bacon egg bites. I'm really hoping these are good. A kombucha, some pico, and this ranch, because I love ranch, and I think this one's gonna be good. So, I think I'm gonna make like a little rice bowl or a little salad, so I will show you that when I do it. Dinner time. Okay, I just finished making my salad. I'm also gonna have a cherry coke because why not? And watch Pretty Little Liars and have a little chill night because I have to be up at like 4.45 tomorrow for lift, so. Hello everyone, it is now 9.40 p.m. I'm getting ready for bed. I washed my hair after um, I ate dinner and I just blow dried and straightened it so it's all nice and clean. But I'm gonna do a little skincare before I go to bed. I was just watching Pretty Little Liars on my iPad while I did my hair. I figured I'd show you what I've been using to wash my face. I either use this, boy I think it's Bioma or Boima or something like that. Um, this cleansing balm or I use this go pure um, face wash back I use this one I think you can use both of them and um, the same like wash if that makes sense I'm pretty sure this cleansing balm is more for like taking makeup off and then this is more cleaning your skin but I just used this today because I wasn't wearing any makeup sorry about this angle too <laughs> anyway next I go in with this clarifying serum by the same brand this is actually at Target too which is really convenient and it's really not expensive for skincare whatsoever and so far I like it I mean ignore the breakout right here this is just unrelated but I really like it I really do and I like that it's all colorful and like pretty to look at okay next I go with this deep puff and brightening eye gel one I'm trying to do everything now so that I don't have wrinkles when I'm old and two my eyes get so puffy from getting up so early and stuff like that um and just the weather here it's been like really hot to cold and i'm like very congested and i see it a lot in my eyes and face just look puffy and like inflamed so we're gonna put that on we finish off with the poema moisturizing rich cream that in. and then lastly my lips are literally so chapped because of the weather so i've been using this little burt's bees watermelon moisturizing lip balm i really like it and i think it's really cute and now i'm gonna take out my contacts and go to bed so i will talk to you at like 4:50 or 5 tomorrow morning on the way to lift hello everyone good well i can't say good morning good afternoon i have been up actually for a long time but i've just been chilling i have a nice chill saturday morning which honestly was so needed and i just wanted to have a few like good hours of rotting and watching tv and doing whatever i wanted because life's about to get so 
crazy. We have a horse show tomorrow, so it'll be our second one of the season. And we're actually on fall break, so I don't have class Monday or Tuesday. But we have our NCEA tryout on Monday and our IHSA scrimmage on Tuesday. So <laughs> it's gonna be busy. And then obviously the next that next weekend we have I think we have a double header. I think we have an NCEA show and IHSA. So again, it's gonna be a little crazy. So anyway, with saying that, today I'm actually going with two of my teammates to a barn that's like 30 minutes away and I'm going to do a lesson because I want to go over the NCEA flat patterns that we are going to have on Monday. Obviously, it's very different than what I do in or what I did in the Big Egg and stuff like that because the flat patterns are basically dressage patterns. I mean, not nearly as advanced as what dressage riders do, which is just so cool. But like more basic versions of that, it's like trot from this letter to this letter and then haunches in down this side and like things like that. So anyway, I'm gonna go with this and go over that and then after I am going to drive to Dover I think because I need to get some better boot cleaning supplies here um the other stuff is just a little old and needs to be replaced and I have some PR to pick up but anyway I need to get dressed and I will see you on the way out Okay guys, it is now 3.30. I had a great lesson. I feel a lot more prepared now, so I'm really happy. Just made it to Dover. I'm gonna go in and grab a few things because I need a few things. One and two, it was really close to this barn, which is like 35 minutes away from where I live. So I'm gonna grab some things and then we're gonna go back. I'm gonna make some ravioli like pasta um to have. Then I need to do a test and do some work. And then this evening, I'm going to a haunted house with my team. It's like a team thing at seven and it should only be like an hour. And then we're gonna go over the flat patterns again at someone else's house and then I'm gonna have an early night like I need to be asleep by 10 latest because we have an early morning tomorrow but I'll show you what I get from Dover I'm just gonna run it. okay it is 4 35 I just made it home I picked up some packages that I had to get so I finally made it home I am boiling some water now and I'm making tortellini that I got from Trader Joe's because I'm starving. So I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna have this now and then when I get back from the haunted house thing it'll be about eight. I might make like a salad or something lighter. I also have some PR unboxing to do for you guys but I need to do my test first and eat. So if I get to that today I will show you. Okay guys I just finished my test and got ready and I have to head out so I will show you the PR when I get back but this is what I'm wearing. I will try and take a few clips on my phone if I remember but we're going to a haunted house. There's no much to see. Talk to you in a bit. Okay guys, it is now like 9.30 or something. It is, yeah, it's 9.23. I am going to swiftly like get everything together and get ready to go to bed, but I do want to give you guys the haul and stuff I promised. So, quick little Dover haul. I bought a bunch of these sponges for cleaning boots. I bought one of these buffer things. And this is because all my cleaning supplies I keep in my valet normally at home. And um, one, those ones are like also running out anyway. So I need to get new ones. But I figured it's good just to have like a whole set of it here now. Um, and then I got this F FX um, leather balm. I use this to like clean my boots. Um, Urad. I have a slight problem with this. I don't have um, medical gloves, which I normally use. I meant to get at the store, but I forgot. So I'm going to have to use like a paper towel or something to hold it. And that is all I got from Dover. Nothing too exciting. But I do have a package to open, which I believe is PR. So I will put on the screen everything where it's from. It's either superlative or superlative. I'm not exactly sure how you pronounce it, but they sent me some PR. I have a pair of jodhpurs from them and I really love them and they're really, really good quality. It says, hey Elise, we want to thank you for your support with our brand, enjoying the superlative goodies from the Look at this. Okay, first off, we have this beautiful hat. I love the color of this. This is so up my alley and I really like their logo and how it's designed because I feel like I would wear this even if I wasn't going to the barn or something. And then, what is this? Well, they sent me a nice little like oversized tee. I love wearing these. I love wearing them to bed. I love wearing them just with some leggings or something to class. And again, like so, so stinking cute. So thank you so much for sending this. Um, I will leave the link to their shop in the description. Um, I definitely recommend their riding pants. I love them. Anyway, guys, I'm going to really get going. I need to clean up, get my boots polished, get ready to go. 
But thank you so much for watching this vlog. I wanted to let you know in the next vlog, my plan is to do a big like deep clean and reset. I feel like everything's getting really chaotic. We just past midterms so we're halfway through the semester and also the season has started and things are just chaotic and monday and tuesday of my week this will be history by the time you're watching this but for me it's gonna be crazy so my plan is after tuesday so like maybe wednesday i'm gonna reset everything so stay tuned for that but i love you all so much oh i almost forgot to tell you we hit 20,000 subscribers on my main channel today it has been a good day it really has so thank you so much guys i really couldn't be more grateful for your support it means the absolute world to me and i don't know what i would do without you so love you so much and i will see you in my next vlog bye